Hi, everybody. Hi. So I know, I know, I know it looks junky right about now, but I promise you it's for a good cause. So today on the Whipping It Up with Sheree Yerby show, <laughs> we are having our first grocery haul, okay? So I figured um, it's time for me to do a grocery haul because a lot of cooking channels do a grocery haul and uh, I love looking at the grocery hauls to see what people buy. Um, so I figured I would do mine today. Mine is gonna be done in two parts. So just so you know, I go to three, I go to about four different places for my groceries every month, okay? This is not all of it. Um, I have some, some over here to the side that I'm gonna show. Um, this is just a, a portion of it. My other order is coming from Walmart. So I don't even know where I'm gonna put all of this stuff as I show you, but my kitchen is small. So um, I'm working with limited space. So anyway, I'll start with right here. This is my spinach. So I juice a lot. I buy a lot of fruits and vegetables. Um, and I also eat spinach for my breakfast. So I got about four packs of spinach. I get that from a place called Aldi. I got some carrots. And I got some, I'm just going to start up here from what you can see. I got three cartons of eggs. Uh, at the store that I went to, it's called United Grocery here in my city. They had eggs for 99 cents. So definitely, I had to jump on that because I love eggs. I got some vegetable oil. I got strawberries at that United Grocery Place for 99 cents a carton. Can y'all believe that? And these strawberries are beautiful. They're not bu bruised. I think that's how you say it. But I got two of those. And I got some mushrooms. And I got some sweet relish. I'm just gonna push it to the side. And I, we have some garlic because let me tell y'all something, I don't peel garlic. I have a garlic peeler, but I do not peel garlic. So I buy the freshly peeled garlic. I have some parsley and some ginger. Green onions that I use. I got some kale. I love kale. I put that in my juice as well. So let me go ahead and put this in the refrigerator. Over. So this United Grocery Place, they are the bomb. When it comes to meat, listen, you can't be you can't beat them. I got a jumbo pack of chicken legs. I eat a lot of chicken. I'm going to show y'all. I hope y'all can see that. That says $2.91 for about 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 10 drumsticks. $2.91. Y'all, you cannot beat that. And they have their own butcher shop in the back. Like, it's it's pretty. It's not bruised up. Plus, I'm going to clean it. But you cannot beat that. 20 drumsticks for less than $6. If I had got this at Walmart or somewhere like that, it probably would have been about $18. Because as high as they are, it's ridiculous. So, um, prepare my stuff for the freezer. So, since we're doing meats, I may as well... So I got some um, organic grass-fed beef. I got two of those. I got some little Smokies. And 
I love ground sausage. So I got um, that. Got some bacon. I got bacon from two different stores. So that's why I have two different kinds of bacon. I love bacon. Okay, let me just tell y'all right now. I love bacon. I got tuna. I eat tuna. I put it in my lunch every week for my snack. I love tuna. It is a great snack to eat instead of chips. Um, I went old school. Y'all, I got some Charlie's bologna. If y'all ain't up on that Charlie's bologna, and I haven't had Charlie's bologna in years. I had stopped eating bologna, but they had it marked down today for um, a dollar at that United Groceries place. Um, and as you can see, I got some uh, mayonnaise, I got some milk, um, I got some seasonings. Let me get these. So here's my seasonings. I got some, just some parsley. These were 50 cents at the store that I went to, which is why I go to that store because you can really rack up. Um, I got some chicken seasoning for 50 cents. Some Italian seasoning, onion powder, adobo seasoning, and garlic powder. So I got all of that from the grocery store that I went to. Four pans that was marked down to 80, 89 cents. So I definitely need those. Now, this stuff over here, I got some freezer bags. I got those for a dollar at that store and i got some specialty cheese from borzen um garlic and herb cheese that i found and i got some parmesan cheese from the deli i got some fresh mozzarella i'm gonna be making lasagna so just so y'all know i'm gonna surprise my mom as well and take her some lasagna. So um, I got some block cheese that I'm gonna shred up myself. And um, so that's that over here. So now I'm gonna scoop this over so I can turn my camera the other way and show my other part of my groceries. Y'all, y'all just don't know what all I have to go through to do a video for y'all. My goodness. So let me turn my camera around. All right, y'all. So my grocery uh, for vegetables is kind of insane, but I love it because I eat the majority of vegetables. So, yes, and I do have a grocery cart, so don't judge me. So I've had this thing for about six or seven years, and I absolutely love it. So, let's start down here. Let's start at the top. So, we got some, um, we got some romaine lettuce. I make salads every week. And, okay, that just fell. So, these are two stalks of celery right here and then here's a third one of celery and we got some what's back here we got some uh, bell pepper red and orange peppers we got some oranges apples and we got two bags of green peppers and we got a pineapple here three pineapples we got right there and then we got some mini cucumbers for my salad and down here we got Two watermelons back there and then a cantaloupe it's actually two of those cantaloupes oh the other one I put over there on my um, 
on my countertop. So we got two cantaloupes and then we have the last part of the first part of the haul. We got, let me move my buggy down. We got this. So y'all, y'all see that? Those are, that's toilet paper. And then that's two six packs of paper towels. These two right here. Y'all, all those packs each was $1.99 from Walgreens. Y'all listen, if you're not shopping at Walgreens every now and then and checking their website, you missing out because they be having some really good um, deals. $1.99 is not bad, and I've been using this brand for a few years, and it does say compare to Angel Soft. And I'm going to tell y'all, it's the truth. Angel Soft is so soft, it don't leave my, my private parts hurting and scratched up. So that's the, the last of the first part of my grocery haul. Y'all, I really appreciate you um, joining in and watching the channel. And I will bring y'all back for my second part of the grocery haul. I hope you have a good rest of your day. Thank you. Bye. Bye.